Now the question before us is 27 solid iron spheres each of radius r and surface area us are melted to form a sphere with surface area s dash. Find the radius r dash of the new sphere and ratio of s and s dash. Now in this picture you can see that these are the 27 solid spheres where radius is r and their surface area is s and they have been melted and one big sphere has been formed with radius r dash and their surface area is s dash. So now we will calculate the try to solve this question. Now when one shape is melted to form another shape the volume remains the same. Whenever one shape is melted to form another shape volume remains constant. So, here the volume of 27 spheres of radius r is equal to volume of this sphere which is big sphere which has been formed volume of big sphere with radius r dash. So here what is the value of this read, uh, volume of this sphere this is formula is 4 over 3 pi r cube. Here the formula will be also same 4 over 3 pi r cube. This is the formula. We will put in the relevant values 4 over 3, 22 over 7 into what is the value of r in case of radius r? It is r. So, we will use add as it is 4 over 3 22 over 7 what is the value of radius in case of big sphere it is r dash power 3 so now this will be is equal to this this is equal to this so now what is balance is here this is the volume of 27 spheres. So, we have calculated it by 27 because 4 over 3 pi r cube is the value of volume of one sphere as it is these are the seven these are 27 small spheres. So, we will multiply it by 27. So, what is left is 27 r cube is equal to r dash cube. So, now what is r cube r dash 3 r dash cube is equal to 27 r cube. So, now what is r cube r dash cube is equal to we can write it as 3 into 3 into 3 or r into r into r or we can also write it as 3r cube. So, r dash will be equal to 3r that is the radius of big sphere will be equal to the will be equal to the 3 times the radius of the small sphere. So, now 
we will come further. Now, what we have calculated so far is that the radius of big sphere that is this one is equal to three times the radius of original sphere. So, now what is another question before us? This is first we have calculated that r dash is equal to 3r. This is the first answer. Now, what is the, we have to calculate? We have now to calculate ratio of s s dash. It means that the surface area of sphere having radius r and the surface area surface area of sphere with radius with radius r and what is s dash it is the surface area of sphere with radius r dash. So, now why we will put in the relevant values. What is the formula for calculation of surface area of sphere? It is 4 pi r square 4 pi here the radius is r. Now, here the radius is r dash. So, it will now come as 4 pi r square 4 pi. What is the value of r dash? It is 3 r. 4 pi will be cut with 4 pi. So, here it will come as 3R square. So, now what is before us is this it is 9R square. This is before us. So, now in other words, we can say that R square R square it is 1 over 9. That is, we can say that the ratio of S and S dash is 1 is to 9. This is the answer. Now, we will do recap. A sphere is a three-dimensional geometric object that is perfectly round and symmetrical. Any point on the surface of the sphere is at equal distance from the center. A sphere has a smooth and continuous surface with no edges and vertices. A sphere has only one face which is curved. Surface area of the sphere is equal to 4 pi r square and volume of the sphere refers to the amount of space occupied by the sphere in three dimensional space. And volume of the sphere is calculated by the formula 4 over 3 pi r cube. Thanks for watching. If you like our course, please spare some time to give a star rating to our course.